Hi students, today we are going to discuss the new lesson the summit within. HPS Alwalia is the, uh, is the writer of the lesson the summit within. Not just a writer, uh, he is an Indian mountaineer, author, social worker and retired Indian army officer. Okay, HPS Alwalia, in fact Haripal Singh Alwalia. Before you read, Major HPS Alwalia was a member of the first successful Indian expedition to Mount Everest in 1965. He, he was the first person who reached the top of the world, Mount Everest. Okay? The expedition means journey. Okay? Successful Indian expedition to Mount Everest was made by HPS Alwalia, which happened in 1965. How did he feel when he stood on the highest point in the world? What kind of feeling he would have while he was standing on the highest point in the world? Definitely there might be a special, fe special feeling. Okay, There might be a special feeling because he has achieved a tremendous thing. Phenomenal. Okay, so he might have had a special thing. What was the special feeling he had? And also he talks about the summit within. What is that? The summit within. Let us read the lesson by his own words and understand what is that? The summit within. Okay. Let us hear his story in his words. Climbing the summit. Okay. So he shares his experience with us what kind of feeling he had when he was climbing the Mount Everest okay let us hear his story in his words climbing the summit and and then the more difficult task of climbing the summit within he tells something differently different thing what is that you know Climbing the summit is one thing and also climbing the summit within. What is the difference? Why he says climbing the summit within is more difficult task. Okay, He compares two things. One is climbing the mount, climbing the summit and another one is climbing the summit within. Okay, Here the author talks about two different phenomena. One is climbing the summit and the second one is climbing the summit within and he tells climbing the summit within is more difficult task he compares and also he says something is difficult more than climbing the summit what is that let us read the lesson and understand okay the story the experience has been narrated by his own words by HPS Alwalia Haripal Singh Alwalia Major Haripal Singh Alwalia Let us read the lesson and understand Okay Of all the emotions Which surged through me As I stood on the summit of Everest Of all the emotions Which surged through me As I stood on the summit of Everest so I had many, I had different kind of feelings when, when I was standing on the peak, the toppest point, the most highest point in the world, okay, the summit of Everest. I had really different kind of feeling, okay, looking over miles of panorama below us, looking over miles of panorama, okay, it's the toppest okay top when he was uh, looking down it, it is really too long looking over miles of panorama below us okay because he is standing now in the topest point from there he was just looking down panorama means view of a so panorama means view of a wide area the physical in me seemed to say 
thank God it is all over. The physical in me means the physical pain I got while I was climbing the mountain. When I was at, when I was reaching the uh, summit, okay, the physical pain s seemed to say, thank God it's all over because he felt so much pain while he was trying his journey. Okay, the physical in me seemed to say, thank God it is all over. However, instead of being jubilant, there was a tinge of sadness. There was a tinge of sadness. Yes, he has achieved a tremendous thing. But, yes, of course he was happy. But along with that happiness, he felt a bit of sadness. Why? What was that reason he felt kind of sadness? In the, of course he was happy. Jubilant means jubilant very happy because of success okay he he has he has achieved what he had planned okay so he might be happy he of course he should be happy but there was a tinge of sadness why that sadness was it because i had already done the ultimate in climbing and there would be nothing higher to climb and all roads hereafter would lead down. So this is the highest point to climb in the world. I have reached it. There is no more higher point from here. Here, hereafter, the road will go down only. Okay. So that is what the reason why I felt bit of sadness. Okay. Was it because I had already done? I had done. I am done. But hereafter I have to go down only okay there is no more higher point from here that is why he felt kind of sadness was it because I had already done the ultimate in climbing and there would be nothing higher to climb and all roads hereafter would lead down tinge means uh, tra trace and sad okay next by climbing the summit of Everest you are overwhelmed by a deep sense of joy. By climbing the summit of Everest, you are overwhelmed by a deep sense of joy and thankfulness. So I have reached that point, and the point I reached for the Kapro and Kulu were feeling in the chip, other thankfulness and deep sense of joy. Okay, you know, Marcella and the Rumba, the amount of feeling overwhelmed by a deep sense of joy. And thankfulness okay it is a joy which lost lifetime okay the happiness which I got really lasting through lifetime it is a joy which lost a lifetime the experience changes you completely the experience changes you completely what was that what was that experience climbing mountain okay before he starts his journey, he was something different. Okay, once he achieved his goal, definitely he would be a different kind of person. The journey from the top, from bottom point to top point, experience taught me so many things. That is why here the author um, very particularly uh, remark: the experience changes you completely. Okay. The experience changes you completely. The man who has been to the mountains is never the same again. Okay. Urtha vandu and the journey start pandra per irkna liya. Adhe pola vandu thirumbu vara modhir kumara kandi pa. He would have learnt so many things because of the experience. It would it would be uh, teach so many things. As I look back at life after climbing Everest. I cannot help remarking about the other summit. The summit of the mind. Okay. Here the writer talks about the different kind of the summit. The summit of 
the mind no less formidable and no easier to climb i have achieved climbing mountain but this summit is something different it is not so easy to climb no less formidable no less formidable means formidable means challenging it is also challenging thing okay even when getting down from the summit once the physical exhaustion had gone exhaustion means fatigue tiredness i began asking myself the question why i had climbed everest see even when getting down from the summit once the physical exhaustion had had gone i began asking myself the question i why i had climbed everest na enakulla and the kelvigala kekka aramicha eppa na enoda and the physical exhaustion fatigue la irukum illaya and the kalaippu adha ponadukaprom enakulla naane sila kelvigala ketta enna na i began asking myself the question why i had climbed everest yena எவரஸ்ட கிளைம் பண்ண கிளைம் பண்ணுன்னு சொல்லி நான் எனக்குள்ள ஒரு கேள்வியை நான் கேட்டுக்கிட்டேன் மை இமேஜினேஷன் வாய் டிட் த ஆக்ட் ஆஃப் ரீச்சிங் த சமிட் ஹாவ் சச் அ ஹோல்ட் ஒரு ஒரு ஸ்ட்ராங்கான ஒரு ஒரு மனசுல ரொம்ப பதிஞ்சிருச்சு ஓகே வை வாய் டிட் த ஆக்ட் ஆஃப் ரீச்சிங் த சமிட் ஹாவ் சச் அ ஹோல்ட் ஆன் மை இமேஜினேஷன் it was already a thing of the past something done yesterday in the every passing day it would become more remote every passing day it would become more remote over and all over and all aga 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 pathina and the imagination in our mind la irundad illaya adu vandu konja konjama konja konjama doora poirum naabathula vandu konja konjama marandu perum and then what would remain would my memories fade slowly away all these thoughts led me let me let me to question myself as so all these thoughts led me to question myself as to why people climb mountains nimma neriya thoughts la my mind la vanduchu idella vandu enakulla oru kelvigala uruvaaguchu enna maadhirina why people climb mountains okay கொஞ்ச நாள்ல வந்து பாத்தீங்கன்னா ஃபர்ஸ்ட் ஹாப்பியா தான் இருந்துச்சு பட் நாளாக நாளாக அது நம்ம மைண்ட்ல இருந்து அது ரிமோட்டா போயிடும் ரிமோட்னா கொஞ்சம் டிஸ்டன்ஸ் மைண்ட்ல இருந்து தூரம் போயிடும் ஃபேடா ஃபேடாவே மைண்ட்ல இருந்து மறைஞ்சிடும் ஸோ வாய் பீப்புள் கிளைம் மவுண்டேன் இட் இஸ் நாட் ஈஸி டு ஆன்சர் த கொஸ்டின் த சிம்பிளஸ்ட் ஆன்சர் வுட் பி அஸ் அதர்ஸ் ஹாவ் செட் பிகாஸ் இட் இஸ் தேட் it presents great difficulties man takes delight in overcoming obstacles see there are there are so many difficulties but still people love to climb mountain why is that okay the simplest answer would be as that as the as others have said because it because it is because it is that it presents great difficulties okay uh, climbing mountain gives much difficulties Ma- man takes delight in overcoming obstacles namakku vandu edha oru tadaiyila taandi varumbodhu namalukku pathina oru oru happiness oru oru satisfaction namal vandu satisfy aagum okay self satisfaction kedaikum man takes delight happiness in overcoming obstacles the obstacles in climbing a mountain are physical okay or climbing or mountain climb pannumbodhu and the obstacles la paathina physical problem namalukku adhigama irukum ena avlo easy kediyadhu mountain and mari highest point reach pandradhu adu reach pannitomna adu vandu physical pain mattum dhaan irukum a climb to a summit means endurance persistence and will power a climb to a summit means endurance persistence and will power so or or summit climb pannumna enna nala thevana endurance irukonu 
persistence and will power endurance means tolerance persistence firmness will power determination okay the demonstration of this physical qualities is no doubt exhilarating as it was for me also very exciting exhilarating means very exciting the demonstration of these physical qualities what are those physical qualities endurance persistence will power these are the physical qualities Demonst when you demonstrate these physical qualities you can achieve the climbing mount mountain mount everest okay the demonstration of these physical qualities is no uh, doubt exhilarating okay very exciting as it was for me also i have more personal answer to the question from my childhood i have been attracted by mountains okay chinna vayasil irundha enakku the mountains na romba pidikum i had been miserable lost when away from mountains na mountains vittu vilagi pona thalli pona ala pathina enakku vandu oru oru miserable i felt miserable and lost mountains are nature at its best irukra natures le pathina mountains na romba best appdi solradhu their beauty and majesty pose a great challenge and like many i believe that mountains are a means of communication with the god nare bel nanichirukanga laya and the mountain poradhu pathina or communicate god oda communicate pandra meriyo adhe pola da nanu and like many i believe na nambra that mountains are a means of communication with the god adhu kadavuloda thodarbu padathi nammale vande ரிலேட் பண்ணிக்கிறது கூட ஒரு வழி தான் இந்த கிளைம்பிங் மவுண்டைன் அப்படின்னு சொல்லி சொல்ற யாரு ஹெச் பி எஸ் அலுவாலியா ஓகே ஹியர் வி ஹாவ் கன்க்ளூடட் த ஃபர்ஸ்ட் பார்ட் இந்த நெக்ஸ்ட் வீடியோ வில் பி டிஸ்கஸ் வில் பி டிஸ்கஸிங் அபவுட் த நெக்ஸ்ட் ஃபர்தர் பார்ட்ஸ் ஓகே தேங்க்யூ